hello guys welcome to another video and today we are going to be unboxing the infinix hot 3 lte yeah you heard that right hot 3 as in the phone that's over a year plus old from infinix they decided to bring it back and retrofit it with a 4g capability and they improved some of the features as well so today we're going to be opening up that phone so you can see what it looks like and let's get to it so the first thing out of the box is the Infinix Hot 3 LTE itself. As you can see, it has a rough plastic back casing. I guess that's for the consumer to be able to tell immediately that this is different from the Hot 3. Now the second thing we see is a little box which contains our USB cable, our earpiece, our battery and the instruction manual. Now the second box contains our charger brick. So that's all that's in the box. Now for the specifications, we have a 5.5 inch HD resolution screen. We have dual SIM support. We have 3000 milliamps of battery. We have a 30 megapixel primary camera and a 5 megapixel secondary camera. We have 2 gigs of RAM, 16 gigs of internal storage. OTG support and 4G LTE which is one of the biggest selling points of this phone and let's not forget that Infinix decided to bump the processor up from a quad core processor to an octa core processor and the device runs on Android 5.1 now in terms of hardware at the top of the phone we have a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and a USB 2.0 port on the right side of the phone we have our volume rocker and our power button on the bottom of the phone we have just a tiny microphone and on the left side of the phone we have absolutely nothing as you can see at the back of the phone we have our 30 megapixel camera our flash and another mic and if you open up the back you can see that we have our space for two micro sim cards and one memory card which means there is no hybrid slot we have the same setup we had with the hot 3 now the thing I noticed about this phone is that apart from the differences in the spec sheets like the processor bump and the 4G LTB added on, there is absolutely no difference between this device and the original Infinix Hot 3. It's more of a feature update and they did quite well with it. If you prefer this design to the bulky design of the Infinix Hot 4, this would definitely be a better alternative is around the same price point as the hot 4 and let's not forget that the hot 4 doesn't have 4g lte so which gives this device a little bit of an edge compared to that but everything just depends on choice if you don't like the bulky design of the infinix hot 4 and you want 4g lte on your device around the same price point i think this is the new best choice so thanks guys for watching this video watch out for more videos coming out on the channel very soon Thank you for supporting this channel and see you guys next time.